What's up guys, Jockta17 here, and we are back to the blind LP of the Legend of Dragoon. Alright, so we left off here in Mayful after just reuniting with our old buddy Lavitz and rekindling the bromance between him and Dart. But now we're gonna have to go onward, so let's get going. Let's get going. We pretty much hit the point of no return at this point, I think. Let's go. This is the point of no return. Once we go up, there's no return. We are going. Yes. Let's go. Lavitz showed us the way. I have no hesitation. Let's go. Let's see. Is this the final dungeon? Because I'm already at the point of no return. Alright. Well, first things first. Treasure chest! Spectral flash, another attack item. Alright. Got. It was safe. And that signet spear is the last barrier to protect the world. If it is destroyed, there will be no other way but to deal with God itself. When Shauna crosses to the moon that never sets, the God of Destruction will be born? I won't let it. I'll finish it here. I think so too. Dad! I'll finish the world here. Reveal yourself. I don't hide. I'm right here. Our settlement is a peaceful one. We don't need weapons. A fight is not appropriate before the celebration of a birth. I won't let you! Don't come near me! I... I won't let you... Uh-oh, there it goes. The arrow has already been released! To the finale of the world! The moon is falling! It's pulling a Majora's mask on us! The, the world is ending. Does that mean that humans cannot revoke the will of the creator? It's okay. Just play the song a time. You'll be fine. <laughs> Not yet. Don't give up. Come on, Sora. Together we could do it. No, oh, wait. Wrong game. It's just the signet of the moon is broken. Yes. We can still struggle. The moon has not obtained Shauna yet. Let's go pursue Zeeg. Is this a dead end? Hey, buddy. The wings of Savin! Or the airship! Take us to the moon! Alright, here we go. Looks like we're at the final, like the final showdown and whatnot. What do we got?
Whoa! Hello, Meru. I didn't realize how big her boobs were. Huge difference in F and B. Uh, here comes the porno music. Whoa, what's with all the virages? Sorry, I cannot fly anymore. Cool on. Everything is turning out just as Zeke wished. The seal of the moon was broken and the terribly disastrous plan laid by Soa finally has started. Those virages are mere advance guards for the primary virage embryo. It seems the birth of the God of Destruction will only be a matter of time. Does the Divine Tree, which gave birth to all the species, want this as well? The world is not over yet. We can still fight to save it, can't we? After you've seen those, you still can say that. Let's go. The moon that never sets is waiting for us. Do I still have everybody in my party? Okay, yeah, cool. Just checking. Alright, let's go ahead and save the game, I think. Or. Let's see. For the most part, Xenobotos turned out pretty good, so I'm gonna go ahead and save. Alright, let's go. In the divine tree. In the divine tree. Just keep going up and up and up. What's this? Healing spring? Rose, what's this? It's a fruit of the divine tree. It seems to be dried up, though. Fruit. Did all the species really arise from such small things? Only the creature Soa knows that, so it's just a legend for us, but we are standing on the divine tree, which supposedly was in the same legend. We'd better believe it. I guess so. Let's move on. We better hurry up, or there will be no one even to tell the legend. The legend of Dragoon, if you will. Yeah, I knew I was going to get in a boss fight eventually. Boss fight, random encounter. What the hell are those? Lion scorpions? Manticores. Alright. Oh, they don't have much HP. So, it's nice to hear. Alright, Miranda, just defend for now. I need you to get out of those yellow hit point. That yellow hit point gate. Blossom Storm! Blossom Storm. God, that victory theme sucks. 
Oh man. Okay. Let's go. Ooh. Healing spring? I think that this fruit was shed by some kind of fish. One of the fruits arisen from the divine tree. Yes, it was the same for us humans. The god of destruction will start the same way, won't it? Yes, let's move on. Uh, I was hoping for like a healing spring or something. Rock fireflies, anybody? Anywhere? Maybe? Alright, another random encounter. What do we got? Okay, we have another Manticore and... What is that, a buddy? Cute cat. That's what it's called. They called it a cute cat. Well, I don't want to kill a cute cat. Aw, oh, come on, Dart. I, I landed that. Fuck you, game. You know what? Die. You need to die. So I'm not even going to give you a chance to move. Charging spirit. Go ahead, Miranda. Get your SP in. There we go. Alright. Cool, that's out of the way. Let's continue. Alright, come on. Anytime. Awesome. Let's go. Up, oh, move. Oh, come on. Enough with the random encounters. I don't need that shit now. Oh god, leeches? Are those leeches? Ugh. Oh, they're slugs. They look like freaking leeches. Scary ass leeches. They even act like leeches. Ugh. Ugh. Alright, get your SP in, Miranda. Alright, cool, everybody's already charged up. There we go. There we go. Okay, what's in here? This stream, it seems like it's sending a vital force to the moon that never sets. It must be that the divine tree is getting ready to give birth to the god of destruction. Then if we take the stream in this... Yes, it will carry us to the top. Let's hurry. Let me guess, we're all going to get separated because of that now, right? Ooh. Whoa! Oh, never mind. We got right up close. In addition, maybe because we let ourselves flow in the vital force, I feel revitalized. It means that the power of the divine tree that gave birth to all species is still alive. In order to kill all the species, it revived the power. Landing succeeded! Ta! Ugh.
What is that? It looks like a bug. The Congo's landing awaken it. We gotta get going. Acquired white silver dragon's armor. Let me guess, that's for Miranda? Silver dragon armor, yep. Nullifies damage based to light attacks. Gives you magic defense, everything. No reason not to put that on. What's this? Ah, feeling refreshed. Let's get going. Okay. Oh, okay. Let's get going. Uh, what's this? This is one of the fruits, too. Yes, and all the species who were born in this way are about to be annihilated. Rose. Let's get going. Well, she speaks the truth, Dart. <laughs> they need to be annihilated. Oh, save point. Which means boss fight coming up. A random encounter? Alrighty, here we are, back at the save point. Let's go ahead and make another save file, just in case. Divide tree, maple, maple, maple. Uh, that's the farthest back one, so let's just go ahead and go there. I'm really taking a big gamble here. But from the looks of things, it looks like everything's recording okay. So, let's just hope and pray. Alright, let's continue. <laughs> All right. We're not done yet, seriously? Okay. Obviously, we're going to get in a boss fight right about now. It'll be soon. Yes, but look at that. It's is that the caterpillar from back there? It's a miracle there was an unhatched fruit left over. Huh? It is a subspecies of a new insect. It was just born and is coming after us. Well, sorry, buggy. Well, somebody call for an exterminator? Go ahead, caterpillar. Ah, oh, killing a caterpillar. Blossom storm. You don't even have much defense either. Then again, you were just born. Oh, I don't like the looks of that. Stunned, of course. Oh, oh, I hate that shit. All right, power down. Again, I'll have Miranda do the healing slash debuffing. Albert, in the meantime, you just do this. Go for it. Oh, yeah. Ha! Dart's back up. Power up, Dart. You're gonna regret this, dude. Oh, now he stunned Miranda. That's super. Oh, or not. Oh, you're gonna die. Bye, Caterpillar. You're gonna die. 
Oh, we're not. Not quite yet. You're a critical hit point, though. You're gonna die after this. <laughs> wow, I'm surprised you're even alive. Yep, dead. Let me guess. That wasn't even my final form and stuff. Can I still use those items? No? Okay. Oh, uh, really? We're gonna go through all three stages, really? First caterpillar, then the pupa, and now we're gonna fight the butterfly. We're really gonna go through that. Alright. I'm just going, I'm just getting Miranda her SP as much as I can. Oh, I fucked that up. That was me. I fucked that up. <laughs> I mean, besides, pupae don't attack. Alright, go ahead. He should hatch after this. There we go. Alright, yep, he's gonna hatch. Butterfly! Imago! Let's see, scale my. Well, just go ahead and attack away. Mm, you still have no defense. Well, again, though, no, better defense than Faust. <laughs> better defense than Faust. You don't even hit hard. Come on. Just keep attacking, Miranda. Get your SP in. One thousand damage. I'm sure power up and power down already wore off at this point. Boom. Yeah, power up and power down already wore off at this point. Uh oh. Uh-oh, status effects. Status effects incoming. I can tell. Okay, maybe not. Okay. So, he's not in critical hit points yet, but, you know, Dart and Albert are doing some pretty decent damage to him, so... All four digits, so... Uh-oh. Ooh! That that hurt a little bit. There we go. Not done yet. Oh, Miranda's gonna get a bunch of SP here in this fight. So far, this boss is pretty easy. Knocking on wood right now, though. Because watch, once I say that, she's gonna unleash like some uber death hit or something. Kamehameha! Nope. Wow, already in critical hit points? Yeah, I ain't worried. Let's finish this. Here's our chance for an all out attack! Let me at him! And. die! No, not yet. Not yet. Maybe this one will finish you. And there you go. Down for the count. That was easy. Good God. Ooh, Moon Serenade, Sun Rhapsody, and Healing Rain. Okay, I'm actually glad I did that boss battle, though. 
Got me some more healing items and MP recovery items. I could definitely use those. We barely defeated it. Let's go. We're almost at the moon. What do you mean barely defeated it? We kicked its ass. We get barely defeated it, my ass. Come on, Dart. We kicked its ass. The strongest thing it had was that stupid Kamehameha crap. Moon that never sets. It is spreading poison all over the world. In order to stop the poison, we have to reach the core of the moon. Before it is too late. Unless Shauna and the core, as Rose says, are wedded, the god of destruction won't be born, right? It is a dilemma for us because we want to take Shauna back. If we don't meet Shauna, and if we could destroy only the core of the moon, the world would be saved. But Zeke is here for sure with Shauna. That is the only chance to save her. We will save both the world and Shauna. Fate is not in the hands of the creator, it's in our hands. We won't let Soa decide the fate of the world. That goes for Shauna's fate as well. We will decide our own fate. I'll carve my own fate. Let's go. Is this the moon that never sets? Yes. It has been long. Very. Let's get going. Alright, let's go. Hmm. Whoa. The moon is shaking? Don't tell me the God of Destruction is about to be born. It cannot be. The birth of the God of Destruction is our death. That's right, we are still alive. Let's go. Must stop my father. Wow. Is this a forest? I thought we stepped into the moon. But indeed, this tree is a true tree. Oh no, we were sent were we sent to the ground? No. Listen, it's the heartbeat of the Virage embryo, the god of destruction. An empty body that is the living corpse from which the soul was taken out by ancient winglies on the day it was conceived in the divine tree. We must be in the moon. Then no matter what it looks like, we gotta keep going. Treasure chest, what do we got? Frozen jet, more attack items, lovely. And another random encounter inside the moon, what do we got? A uh, really hairy unicorn. Oof. Alright, what do we got? Unicorn, huh? Ironic. Alright, let's go. Yeah, just get out of here. You don't stand a chance. So far, the hardest fight I've ever encountered was Faust. Then again, he is the ultimate super boss of the game, so that makes sense. If anybody else gave me trouble, it was the Divine Dragon Ghost. Just obliterates Albert before he dies.
What the heck? It looks like a grassland. Huh. Miranda, what's wrong? I know this place. Does it look like the forest of your home? Not only that, it is the forest of Milesa So where I grew up. I'll be back soon, sorry, but wait for me here. There is something I have to check, alone. Miranda? As I expected, this is the forest of my home. Why is this in the moon? This rose is... Mother, where are you going? Go home, Miranda. Huh? You have a kid? Um, yeah. Mother, don't go! Father is calling you! What are you gonna do? Because I married that man, my life has been completely ruined. He hardly works and drinks all the time with the money I earned. I don't even have enough food and I am starving every day. I cannot stand it anymore. A beautiful life must be waiting for me if I leave this forest. Yes, I can say farewell to this miserable life. Now, let's go. No, mother! At least take your kid with you, you little bitch! What, what, Nani? Boss fight? And they're playing the good boss theme, too. Oh shit, solo boss? Oh fuck! Just Miranda? It's just a solo boss fight with Miranda, holy shit! Oh crap! And I can't turn into a dragoon, either. All right, let's see what we got. Death Rose. Okay, luckily for me, it doesn't do much damage. Then again, I also have the Phantom Shield on, and... Don't I have two attack items? I should. Yeah, I have two Frozen Jets. I can at least use that. Go! Thirty-six. That's what I'm talking about. Why? Why did you abandon Dad and me? Ah, Miranda. I had no choice. Shut up. Dad fell ill and I became an orphan. You can never imagine how I have lived since then. Ah, it hurts. So just attack a few more times, I'm assuming. Oh hell, you can attack twice. I, I understand that what I've done is unforgivable as a mother, but I want you to understand. What do you want me to understand? I worked because I didn't want you, a newborn baby, to starve, but he didn't even try to work. My father may not have been a respected man, but at least he was with me all the time, unlike you. Ah, it hurts. So obviously, I think this boss battle's fixed, obviously. I can imagine how angry you are at me, but I never forgot about you, even for a moment. Don't lie to me! It's not a lie. I visited him so many times to take you with me. But every time, he just kicked me out. What? My mother was thinking about me? You have the same name as the goddess of Meal. 
She is pure and loved by everybody. I named you that because it was my wish for you. Ah, it hurts. Oh, she'll get a bunch of SP out of this, that's for sure. Oh, wow, she gets to go a third time. She gonna go a fourth? Oh, wow. Okay. Alright. And that's it. I'm sorry to make you feel lonely, Miranda. Forgive me. I'll forgive you. No, I cannot forgive you! Hmm. I'll forgive you. Oh, you can forgive me? Thank you, Miranda. Obviously, I could have used that as a grinding tool and kept it going. Okay, obviously I could have used that as a grinding tool and just kept going and going and going and going and going and gave her all the experience. All the SP she could have earned. I didn't think about that until after I pressed it. Mother, I was wrong. I entered the palace in order to preach love and to build a world where everybody can live happily, but my heart was filled with sorrow and hatred. And without knowing, I was, I was absorbed in fighting in order to ease my loneliness. I didn't even try to understand my mother's pain and agony, just accumulate hatred and hurt many people. I don't deserve to be a sacred sister. Miranda, what happened? Are you really okay? Your eyes are kinda watery. Sorry, please leave me alone now. Let's go. That's the only thing we can do now. Well, no, no, no. I want my usual party back, please. Bring back Team Damn. Let's go. Oh, treasure chest. Downburst. Got it. What is this? We gotta go forward anyway. Random counter. Mm hmm. I called it. Alright, let's continue. What the hell? There are people? What's going on? Why are people living in the moon? I still don't know, but... Rose, what are you doing? You feel pain. It is certain this is not just an illusion. This world is reality. Indeed, I never visited the moon before, but I cannot help but feel I know this place. People's faces, clothes, it's not a mistake. This is a building in Sergio. I have traveled all over Indianus, and they have typical Sertian faces. Look, the girl over there. Looks Sertian. No, she's not. It cannot be! Disappeared? It looks like that is reality here, too. Uh. Oh, this is where I can go to get treated. Honorable Tail. Yeah! Please, let us get fully healed. You know, I'm just gonna save in the same file from now on, just, just in case. Moon.
<laughs> like it's called Moon. All right, let's go. I understand that this place is not what it appears to be, but where are we now? A world behind the wall? It seems as if the labyrinth of the moon is not refusing us. No, almost as if it's maybe inviting us. Minentos? It seems this place belongs to them. I think they were the 99th species. Maybe they can tell us something about this place. The psych is creating this world. This time, it's whose heart, whose intention. Is it you, or you, or maybe me? You don't see people who you shouldn't see. You see people you have to see. Treasure chest. Spectral flash. Yay, more random encounters coming. Alright, let's continue. Huh? You don't seem to be one of the Munentos. Look at her closely. It's the girl in the room we came from. Oh. She's the girl who disappeared into the wall, isn't she? Hi, what are you doing here? Dart! This girl doesn't know about you yet. What are you talking about? Let me go now. She is Claire. She is inviting me. Claire! Sorry, but please wait for me here. That's his daughter. Hashel? Hashel was right. The girl was inviting Hashel, not you. We can only wait for him. Okay, but as with but as with Miranda, what's going on in the moon? Claire, is it you, Claire? It's me, your father. Don't come here. I hate you, Dad. Claire. Always, always strict discipline. What can I use such a thing for? The power to destroy? The power to hurt people? I don't need such power. I strictly disciplined you since you were little. I only had you. I had to hand my art, this ancestral art, down to the next generation. It's not fair. I just want to sing songs, chit chat with my friends, pick flowers, and fall in love. Our art was never meant to hurt people. It is a martial art to give life to people. Please understand. I don't understand! Boss time! Do you remember the first time we watched Wills? You read my movement in a blink and went on the offensive with swiftness. It was an innate art. I don't think so. I'm just a girl like the ones you can find anywhere. No, you can surpass me. Nobody has been charmed by the war god as much as you, your hidden power. Ah, it's hot inside my body. Dad, help me. Somebody is taking me. Claire, what's wrong? Yeek! All right, and we're fighting our daughter. That's nice. Omni sweep. I hate you, Dad. You did this to my body. It's your fault, Dad. 
No, it's impossible. The transmigration of the war god. Is she demonized? Yeek! Incredible. Nobody has ever reached that level except the founder. Oh, shit! Ugh, what? The black art of Nagajrujuna. For God's destruction, how did Claire learn? Okay, well, I should probably heal myself then. Well, I have six healing reigns. I will live if I lose one here. There we go. Now I can attack again. Ugh, there's nothing I can do. I am the war god. I preside over the art of war and beckon death. It was your desire to awaken me. I am the answer to your long quest. No, you are my Claire. You are not the war god. Leave from the body of my Claire. I can hear. It's the pained voice of Claire. Hang in there. I'm coming to save you. Ah, shoot. I messed that up. But still, Hashel does good damage. I feel your art down to my very core. Mind's eye, awaken! Claire, please forgive me. Mind's eye, awaken! I don't care about myself. I have to save my daughter, Claire. I'll focus all my body and soul into this and kill the devil that possesses my Claire. Thank you, Dad. Hmm. I mean, I like these Soto battles. It's kind of interesting, and you get to, like, connect with the characters a little more. But I kind of wish they were a little bit, like, I don't know, harder. I mean, yeah, I had to use a Healing Rain there, but, like... The way I see it, it's fixed. Forgive me, Claire. Hashel, is it over? Hashel, you also saw the past? Yes, I did, but the past wasn't as bitter as I imagined. It seems everything, both the future and past, are filled in this moon. The future when the world will be destroyed. And our past. Both Miranda and Hashel were made to see the past by the moon, right? They see, as I told you, we are in reality. It's not illusion. Maybe they can do it because they are the 108th species and gods. Let's move on. We wasted lots of time. Albert and Miranda! That's probably going to be my permanent party member, just from here on out. And... There we go. All right, let's continue. Wait, okay, really? All this is for a treasure chest? Flash hall. All right, now let's go back around. All right, let's continue. Wait, uh, do are we not even supposed to go this way? I guess not. I think we're supposed to go back. All right, well, I'll meet you back there then. Okay, we're back here, so let's go ahead and continue then.
Wait, wait, let me guess. The next solo battle is Albert's. Okay, let's see. What else have we got? Ooh, there he is. What is this? The ground is so far away. Are we floating in air? You can stand up. It seems there is an invisible floor. Are we really in the sky? It looks like it, because this is a cloud. Even I've never been in such a high place. Really? Anything can happen. Don't just look at the view forever. We are moving on. Okay, well, I just came from there, and I'm going to get a bot uh, random encounter very soon. Alright, let's go. I picked the path on the right. Alright. Okay, I guess I can't do anything here yet. Let's go. Alright, let's go ahead and continue. Okay, is this where I need to go? Okay, is the random encounter rate here is ridiculously high. But it looks like I made it just in time. That is... Oh no. Michael. No. I, I couldn't have been mistaken. I was with him for more than 10,000 years. Is that your dragon, Rose? It was the... V it was the vassal dragon. My dragon. Run! They're not around here. It's Dart and Rose. They should be fine like us. Of course, it's impossible for them to die from just an attack of a dragon. Eh, it's not impossible, it just rarely happens. She called it Michael. Why did Rose's Vassal Dragon attack us? This is just my guess, but in the moon, I think some sort of feeling that exists in our heart materializes itself. You mean Rose had some caring feelings for her Vassal Dragon? I flew around here, and don't you think this place seems like the home of the Gigantos? Yes, but this was old Holy Land long, long ago. Urgh. There is one hiding down here. Don't miss even one. Annihilate all Gigantos. Urgh. Hey, Dole's coming. Run. <laughs> Ugh, don't remind me of Dole. There will be no one to devastate the Holy Land of the Gigantos, ever. But Your Majesty Dole, we may be too late. Only if Your Majesty Carlo gives us permission to dispatch. Don't talk about him. He is no longer alive. Your Majesty Dole, there's something in here. Come out. A Giganto child? I am the new king of Sertio, Dole. There are no more people to persecute you. You can live in peace from now on. What's your name? Human, get out! Don't be so disrespectful. His Majesty Dole tried to help Gigantos fight against humans. I am a human, but before that, I am a man who wishes the coexistence of all species. Don't you like peace? Me, Kongol. Everybody dead. Kongol, alone. Then come with us. 
Is this something in Kongo's heart? Then is that the truth of my uncle Dole? Emperor Dole, Emperor Dole, Emperor Dole, Emperor Dole. I have something to do. I go now. Oh, so it's Kongles. So it's Kongles battle. From the looks of it. Emperor Dole said strong leader is required to make equal world. Strong leader needs strong power. Congo will get strongest power. Dart needs Congo, so Congo go. Congo, what are you talking about? Wait for him here. So now it's Congo so Congo's solo battle. All right. Endora, so you came. Brother, I became stronger. I see. Brother, the strongest. Kongle admire brother. Bro brother, Kongle's pride. I see. Brother, Kongle needs power to help Dart to save world. I see. Brother, Kongle overcomes now. Kongle overcomes brother. Come! Okay. So, oh, this is Kongo's solo battle now, and he's the Dragoon, isn't he? I'm not worried. Kongo's got a fuck ton of defense. All right, let's go. Bone crush. Bone crush. What's wrong with you? You're so pathetically weak. Oh, damn. Okay, fuck you, you're dead. <laughs> that looks like it hurt. There we go. And this again. Whoa. Okay, Congo's fine. You'll be fine. There we go. Congo's a tank. I'm really not worried about it. Whoa! Yeah, that is Congo's brother. You can tell. Okay. Yeah, he's he's already in critical hit points. All right, he's dead. Coolio. That was easy. Endora's axe. So let me guess, that's Congo's strongest weapon in the game? Congo, a hero, a strongest hero of Gigantos. Brother. Go to the people who need your power. Brother, Kongle is to fulfill desire is the power of destruction. To care for others is the power of truth. You receive the power to overcome Endura. The strongest power, Kongle, the pride of Endura. Well done, brother. You conquered it, didn't you? Brother praised Kongle. First time for Kongle to praise. Kongle happy. But what does the moon want to show us? 
It's not a moon anymore. It's the flesh of the God of Destruction. And what is the God of Destruction wants is to show us his annihilation. Let's go. We gotta look for Dart and Rose. Okay, is Kongo in my party or no? Okay. Well, might as well equip it anyways. Who knows? Maybe I have to use Kongo again. I don't know. Kongo, Kongo, Kongo. I'm sure that's probably his strongest weapon in the game. Endura's Axe. Instantly kills enemy with given probability. Well, it's better than the weapon he has on, so might as well. Alright. Let's get out of here. Okay, I guess there was no reason to come in here then. Then why would they make that an option? Oh well, I don't care. I just want to get with the story and beat this game already. Besides, I got work in an hour! Can I go to the left? Yep. Let's get out of here. So let's see, who's left? Um, Albert. Meru. And... Dart and Rose. If I remember correctly, if I went to Sergio, um, they said Emperor Dor went to go fight the Gigantos. So... Now I can go back to Sergio and do uh, Albert's fight, I'm assuming. We couldn't find Dart anywhere. Hmm, maybe it's better to wait for them somewhere rather than blindly looking around. Then let's wait here. This town is the only place there are lots of people. It seems that is the right thing to do. Okay, and meanwhile... I understand that we lost everybody because the dragon attacked us, but why? Why did your Vassal dragon attack us, Rose? Was it to bring the two of us here? The place filled with dragons? I think we will find out soon. Let's go. Either to destroy the Virage embryo or to fight against Zeig. I need everybody with me. Rose, don't be so shocked. I trust everybody too. Ooh, Rose is actually following us. That's a first. Rose, what are these? This is a baby dragon. It was called the Pseudo Dragon. It seems everything, including the future and the past, exists here. My favorite Pseudo Dragons didn't make it to the present age, but I am encountering the past now. But we don't have time to be sentimental. Let's go. Hmm. I wonder how baby dragons would look. It'd be pretty cute. Then again, I've already seen Harry Potter, so... I already know how they look. Can I carry any more items? Oh, item capacity. I hate you so much. With a vengeance. Did you hear me? Vengeance. Night raid. All that for a night raid. Yay. I mean, I do like, I do like those items, but not that much. Dart, can you wait a little? He's calling me over there. Okay. Come on, you can make it, you can make it, you can make it, you can make it. Yes. Okay. 
There he is. I knew it. I know this place. It's where I met Michael for the first time. Darkness Dragon. Sorry, we don't have time. Wingleys are mighty. Mighty enough to annihilate us and the entire species. In order to liberate humans, we have to sacrifice you, dragon. Now is the time to decide, extinction or war? We choose war. The dragoon spirit left by the darkness dragon and this newborn dragon will be the spearhead of the war. This... This baby needs a name. Black Burst Dragon, Michael. How about Michael? Rose's Vassal Dragon, the Darkness Dragoon, the Black Burst Dragon, Michael. It's a good name. So now can we go? Yes. The real war has not started yet. Michael, don't you recognize me? Boss time! <laughs> Michael. Zero damage. Ow. Maybe Rose is the only one that can do it? Oh, wow, I messed up. Zero damage, though. Well, might as well just defend, then. Michael, it's me, Rose. Don't you recognize me? It seems not to be working. It's out of control, just like last time. He forgot the pride of the dragon and turned himself into a mere raving beast. It, it has a wildness even beyond that of Fairbrand. Damn! Damn it, come on, I usually always land that. Not this time. I could clear up my inventory right now. I could clear up my inventory right now. But I guess that wouldn't be smart. Let's go. I landed that, come on! Okay, screw you, you're dead. <laughs> screw you, you're dead. I landed that. What a dragon, it yields to neither sword nor magic. The darkness dragon is the strongest dragon of all, having the best attack and defense along with having the best agility. I don't need to hear about it, is there any way to defeat him? Just guard heal for now I guess. Just keep guarding I guess until he... Until they tell us what to do. Hey. 
Michael Shell a special armor for the Darkness Dragon and repels any attack by the enemy. What should we do? There is only one blind spot. What is it? Tell me now. Well, if Rose knows it... Demons dance. Demons dance. I'm just going to keep guard healing until they tell us what to do. God, what should I do? I can't tell Dart the blind spot. After he shoots the black laser, his defense falls a second, showing his heart. That's his only weak spot. Okay, and then he's firing his laser right now. Fire the laser! <laughs> there it is. I... I don't know what is up with you, game. I am landing that, okay? There we go. Oh, is he dead? Is that it already? Wow. That was it? Just one blazing dynamo from Dart and that was it? That was probably one of the easiest boss fights ever. Just guard heal, guard heal, guard heal, guard heal, guard heal, and then just attack. The dragon's body is capable of enormous endurance, but its heart is not. After many fights, it becomes savage and starts to blindly attack people, and in the end, it won't listen to the orders of dragoons either. That's why I killed Michael. I killed him with these hands. That's enough of looking back at the past. You have lived for 10,000 years because you didn't want to see the future to be destroyed. Right, Rose? You are right. Thank you. You reminded me of what's important. Let's look for Albert and the others. We, then we have to head to the core of the moon. Yes, let's continue. Let's go, 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 go. Oh, you can make it. You can make it. You can make it. You can make it. Damn it. All right, let's continue. Okay, we're jumping. Ooh, item. Cannot carry any more items! <laughs> Ooh, I hate this item capacity so much! You know, discard. What, what do I not want? What do I not want? Mm. I don't want you. There. Now what is it? Burning wave! Hmm... I think I go down. No, this is where I ended up last time. I think I just keep going straight, don't I? Or am I just going in a complete circle? There it is. Yeah, right there. Damn it! Come on! Enough!
Alright, oh crap, fork in the road. Let's go down. Oh, yeah, looks like I ended up in the right place. There they are. Dart, Rose! We were right about waiting here. All of you look alright. Of course, we cannot fall until we complete our mission. Now, before we leave, let's exchange information. I see. Dole was in the home of Gigantos to save Gigantos. Hmm. It wasn't the cruel uncle we've known, but it's that Dole who killed King Carlo. I think we will find out that what the moon wants to show us when we meet Dole. Besides, I think we have to see it in order to proceed, given the facts so far. That's right. Let's go out of, to the town now. Alright. Team Dam. Sorry, Team Dam. Thank you. Yeah, sorry, Team Dam. But... Unfortunately, I have to stop here. If I go on anymore, I'll be late for work, unfortunately. Plus, I've been recording for an hour and a half already. I'm going to have to end the episode right here. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, don't forget to hammer, smash, and stab that like button and subscribe, of course. And I will see you guys next time. See you guys later. Be safe. Eat that a shy. Don't overdo it.